promised. You promised you weren't going to work today. Hey, it's not my fault. The Latin American Commerce Commission. I need your excuses. Boy, I didn't know they were going to send one of their representatives today, but they did. They bark, I jump, my dear ex-wife. You don't jump when anyone barks. Oh, well, excuse me for trying to close the biggest deal of my life. Eric is singing at 2.30. You be there. What's wrong? Nothing is wrong. Mm -hmm. Except I needed a kiss. And it looks like something's come up for your daddy. So I'm thinking he might not be able to make it. I don't it. care. Christmas Eve party. Can't expect me to work all day. But when is he Santa, Daddy? Mm. He's a lucky guy, Morgan. Why aren't you coming with us? I got work to do. And it's because of that work that Daddy's able to take such good care of us. That's right. Can I tell Santa what you want for Christmas, Daddy? The day off would be nice. Look, I don't want anything for Christmas. I got everything I need right here. Okay? Mm. You better get in there before Calvin throws a fit. All right. Now let's not keep Santa waiting. Here you go. Bye, guys. Oh, bye. bye. Calvin? Who they sent? Isabel Freyas, VP International Markets. From Brazil. How's your Spanish? Brazilians speak Portuguese. And she's on her way to Sao Paulo from? A New York, where she was meeting with the CEOs of nothing over 97 cents and bargain guys. Why on earth is she wasting her time with those losers, huh? Sao Paulo. Repeat after me. Sao. Sao. Paulo. 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 What are we thinking, Drew? Failure is not an option. Yes. And what are we going to be doing to our competition, Drew? We're going to bury them. Let's start digging their graves. Right. Morning, Stacy. She's here. What? Our plane was early. Did you get the coffee and fruit? All set up. Coffee and fruit? Are you kidding me? Is that the best we could do? It's the Brazilian breakfast of choice. Huh. Perfect. Can we send Stacy home? Oh, absolutely not. What if we need more coffee and fruit? Mr. Carter. Please, it's, uh, it's Calvin. Isabel Frias. Oh, it's so nice to finally meet you. Uh, this is my executive assistant, Drew Quinn. Drew, Miss Freya. Hello. It's so kind of you both to meet with me so short notice. And on Christmas Eve. Well, we would meet with you anytime, anywhere. Eye on the prize. That's our motto. That's right. This breakfast is marvelous, by the way. Huh. On a day when I should be with my family, it makes me feel right at home. Well, I hoped it would. Ah, so, let me tell you a little bit about our company. It's a classic mom and pop store. Started off with a dozen bobby pins, some shoelaces, and a real American work ethic. You know all the words you song? No. <laughs> Come on. No. Come on, honey. Come on. <laughs> oh. Hey, it's, it snowed right. last night. Hey, Grandpa. Hey, Grandpa. Actually, Dad, it snowed a few days ago. Well, I knew that. But I do know that today is Christmas Eve. And you know what that means, kids? Party! Yeah, party. our world-famous party. Yes. Candy cane. Aww. Just the oatmeal. Uh, uh, the Dad? Bag. Dad, I'm sure everybody at the store would understand if you couldn't handle the canes today. It's a tradition. 
We're doing it. You're the boss. Huh. Don't you forget it, okay? Our industry-leading margins give our investors a more competitive return for their money. Now, as we expand into Latin America, we're going to be looking for equity investors to combine our margin expertise with local purchasing power. I like your sell, Mr. Carter. I've read your business plan. I wouldn't be here if I didn't think you had tremendous potential. Oh, beyond tremendous, beyond. But I didn't take a detour on my way home so you could tell me face to face what I already know. You took your failing family business. In chapter 11, the day I took over from my father, in the black a year after that. And turned it into one of the biggest discount chains in America. As of last quarter, number two, and climbing. We have a say in Brazil. Ante ação que mal acompanharam. Better alone than in bad company. To understand your company, I need to understand you. To see for Latin America, you will be good company. Oh, anything you like. I'm, I'm all yours. I want to visit your stores. Get to know what's special about you and your world. Absolutely. How much time have you got? My flight isn't until 9 tonight. Well, here it is, our flagship store, where it all began. Quaint. Uh, Kelvin, Kelvin, how long are you going to need me today? Uh, until we're done. But it's Christmas Eve. Eye on the prize, Drew. Failure is not an option. Oh, slow up, big brother, slow up. Kelvin! <laughs> Hey. What a nice surprise. Hey. Dad's going to be so pleased to see you. Hey, good to see you, Drew. Hey, nice to see you. Come on, let's go say hi to Dad. Oh, oh, oh. Bob's. Could you show me your storeroom? Right this way. Merry Christmas. Have a candy cane. Thank you. He's not here to see Dad do the candy cane thing. No. <laughs> Silly me. I thought just this once he'd put family before business. Uh, this Latin American rap, it's important. <sighs> Have a good Christmas, Drew. And yeah, Merry Christmas, Jesse. Merry Christmas. Hello? Mariana, hi, it's Drew. Oh, Drew, hi. Yeah, he's still with the Latin American rap. Uh, listen. He'd, um, he'd like to take her someplace nice for lunch, and um, he was wondering about the reservation that we've had at Le Petit Maison. Oh, but the reservation's for two. I don't think they can add an extra. Uh, that's not really what he had in mind. He wants to take her in my place? On my reservation? Can you put him on the phone? Drew, Drew. Uh, he can't come to the phone right now. He's, uh, he's showing her the elementary school he used anyway, to go to, if you no. can believe it. Uh, so, what do you say about that reservation? Sure. Why not? So for me, expanding south of the border and bringing on local partners, it's more than just good business. It's goodwill. And it's a chance to bring both our Americas together. I couldn't agree with you more. Great, great, great. Cheers. I thought you'd like to know the concert is over. Oh. Can I say hi to him? No. No, you can't say hi to him. You can talk to him tomorrow. You are coming over for Christmas, aren't you? I'll definitely try. No, don't try, Calvin. Just 
Be there. Sorry. I'm interested in a little dessert. Absolutely. You are? Oh, I can't oh, wait. Terrific. Well, have a nice time. I'll be just a couple of minutes. Thanks. Drew was actually really instrumental in finding local artisans, craftspeople to work on this, on this design. Panda? Panda on the tree? No, a pie. it's a candy tree. <laughs> Crystal, you want to show Grandpa your horse? Show Grandpa your horses. Who's that one? Well, that's Marilyn, Dad. Calvin's ex-wife. You, you saw her this afternoon. Right, but they're divorced. I mean, why isn't she with her own family? Well, because Eric, your grandson, likes to spend Christmas with his cousins. I know my grandson. I'm not completely out of my mind, you know. I've had a wonderful time. You, your business, Drew. Everything exceeded my expectation. An unusual Christmas Eve, to be sure, but oh, you made it very special. I'm going to give your business plan a very serious consideration. Merry Christmas, Carl. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Goodbye. Thank you. We did it, Trister. We sold her. Latin America is ours. Well, it's, it's <laughs> not definitive. Ah, close enough. Hey, this calls for a drink. Oh, look, it's later. I should be getting... Come on! You deserve it. Come on. All right, one. <laughs> pinatas. That's what we need. Start stocking the store with pinatas. All right, put, I'll get on there. But don't put candy in them. Don't put anything in them. Nothing in them? Yeah, people will have to buy the candy to put into the pinatas. Hey, Latin America. Tomorrow, El Mundo. Cheers. Let me ask you something. Man to man. Was it my imagination? Or was Isabel coming on to me? Huh? Look, I should be getting home. Huh? Have a uh, fantastic dinner with your family. Actually, they already ate. Tara's parents came over early. Well, I'm sure she kept the plate warm. Merry Christmas. Ha, <laughs> ha, 
Hello? Hello? Doctor? Nurse? Hi, Calvin. I'm Angie. Where am I? County General? No. So, where am I? Right here. What happened? How do you mean? The sign. On my building, the huge hand was coming right at me. I, I thought I was toast. Pancake is more like it. Yeah. Um, I would like to see a doctor now, please. No doctors on duty. Well, then I need to call my personal physician. He doesn't have privileges here. Well, you don't even know who he is. Sherman Kleinbaum, 1310 Elm. This is ridiculous. There's nothing wrong with me. Hey, you gotta calm down. You're spiking the meter. Well, it's obvious that the sign didn't hit me, so I'm going home. I wouldn't do that if I were you. Why? Is there... Is there something wrong with me? It's internal. <gasps> is it serious? Yeah. <sighs> Am I gonna make it? At this point, we just don't know. <sighs> having the best Christmas Eve of my life. You did? The best ever? Yes. Wow. Congratulations. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Eager fever. We're still on for lunch today, right? What? La Petite Maison, one o'clock. Took me months to snag the reservation. Uh, another reservation? Let's not waste it. Hmm. Good luck today. Coffee. Are you okay? I... I don't know. Aren't you going to the office? It's Christmas. <laughs> no, it's Christmas Eve. You know, either I'm experiencing the weirdest deja vu ever, or I've actually lived this day before. <laughs> Was it at least a good day? It's great. Good. So enjoy it all over again and make it perfect. Good morning, Mr. Carter. Hey. Right. We've done this before, haven't we? Done what? Well, I come out. You say morning, Mr. Carter. Well, yeah, we pretty much do this every day. Okay, Mr. C. Sorry, yeah. Feeling like a hamster on a wheel, Harry. Like a hamster. On a wheel. Isabel Frias, Brazilian speaks Portuguese. Drew, is time relative? I mean, does time warp back in on itself? And if so, why? I don't know. I've never really thought about it before. Why? It's got to be. 
me a reason. Morning, Stacy. I know. She's already here. If in the midst of difficulties we are ready to seize an advantage, we may extricate ourselves from misfortune. The art of war. Make it perfect. Make it perfect. Miss Frias? Hi, Calvin Carter. <laughs> Have we met? before? Um, don't believe so. Oh, how, how marvelous it is to see you. Uh, are you enjoying breakfast? It seemed to us that on a day where you probably wish you were with your family, coffee and fruit would make you feel right at home. Yes, it certainly does. Oh, good. Mm. Oh. I bet you've read our business plan. Yes, I have. And you didn't take a detour on your way home, so I could tell you face to face what you already know. Did you? Well, no, I didn't. You know what? I think you and I should spend a day together to get to know me and my world, this, this special city which gave birth to the buck stops here. I like that. All right. Do you have the time, Miss Frias? Oh, sure she does. Her flight's not until 9. Interesting. Calvin, how long are you going to need me today? This is the place for candy cane. Welcome to our store. Uh, hi. I have some calls to make. You take her and show her around. Oh, this is a place for You know, we have an old saying in America. Better alone than in bad company. So do we. Oh. It's a good company. Something important we have to do. On the third day of Christmas, my king will be to me. Three French and two turtle dogs and a partridge in a pear tree. On the third day of Christmas, my king will be to me. Four holy birds, three French and two turtle dogs and a partridge in a pear tree. Hey! You made it! Of course I made it. You rock! Dude, you were great. Hey, this is uh, Ms. Frias, my new friend. She's visiting us from Brazil. Calvin? Oh, uh, maybe I'll show up. Uh, uh, you know what? We really gotta, we gotta go. We gotta pass schedule. Oh, wonderful boy. Uh, Daddy's pride and joy. Beautiful. It would be inappropriate for me at this time to say anything on the record, but off the record, Welcome to Latin America. Oh, Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Merry Christmas, Merry Christmas. Sir. Oh. Goodbye. Goodbye. Thank you. Perfect, perfect. That, that, that was perfect. Okay, let's have a drink. Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, <laughs> you don't get fooled again.
just had the greatest dream until the last part. When that big old snowblow ran you over? Yeah. How'd you know that? You think an important guy like you is gonna get assigned a candy striper? Sweet dreams. You okay? It's a test. Uh, it's got to be some kind of test. What has to be some kind of test? Do not repeat the tactics which have gained you one victory, but let your methods be regulated by the infinite variety of circumstances. The art of war. My path today. Wait, watch, listen, and learn. Well, I have the day off. My path? Dress shop, La Petite Maison, one o'clock. Don't forget. spend a day with someone so reflective. Oh, he's a deep, deep thinker. Apparently. Well, goodbye. Uh, goodbye. Uh, can I tell Mr. Carter when we might hear about our proposal? There are several proposals on my desk right now. I will let you know. Thank you. Calvin, you okay? It's like Sisyphus. What? Sisyphus. The guy pushing the rock up the hill. At the end of every day, he'd reach the top and then it would roll back down to the bottom and he'd have to do it all over again the next day. Yeah, I know the myth. The question is, were the gods testing him? Or were they punishing him? Look, Calvin, I gotta get home. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Welcome back. 
<laughs> Angie, huh? What's that? Short for Angel? No, just Angie. Huh. Well, then what are you? Are you a ghost of Christmas past or something? Ooh, where are your chains? That's funny. Am I being punished? Uh, am I being punished? Because if, if this is about that little EPA dispute at the Atlanta store, I knew nothing about toxic runoff, OK? We know that. You're not being punished. So then, this is a test, right? This is a test. I, I just wake up on Christmas Eve forever until what? You'll figure it out. Figure it out? I got to know what the angle is. If I'm going to do business with you, I got to know what the angle is. Successful entrepreneur like you, use your imagination. All right, come on, come on. Don't be cute. Just, just give me, give me a clue. Already have. All right. OK, so, all right. I wake up in this kind of ooh, eerie, never, never land, ooh, scary. Having lived my best Christmas Eve ever, and you send me back to live it over and over and over again, because I haven't lived my best Christmas Eve ever? Wow, that was fast. I'm impressed. Ah, but I did, didn't I? Not even close. I sure felt like a great day. Oh, and you don't have forever. You have 12 days. Oh, OK. So I have 12 days to crack this. Well, nine, actually, because you've already had three. Oh, wait a second. Hold it, hold it, hold it. I, I didn't know what the rules were until now. You got to give me 12 more of these, or else the game is rigged. Oh, it's definitely rigged. All right, I'll do 11. Nope. All right, 10. Ten's my final offer. You really think you can negotiate your way out of this, huh? All right, nine's plenty. Good. That's a relief. Because, you know, I'm the one who has to stay here with you, and I hate missing Christmas. <laughs> You're as good as there, Ange. You're as good as there. Good. Hey, good luck. <laughs> luck has nothing to do with it. Brewster? Gird your loins. We're gonna make a little history today. Oh, it's all good. It's all good. Stacy, get me channel seven. Right now you'll be doing a good deed. But this is highly unusual. So? It, it's just. <laughs> Have you researched the tax implications here? Okay. I'll make it as simple for you as I can. If I don't get what I want in five minutes, then in five minutes and one second, I will no longer be a customer at this bank. I'll be right back. Five minutes. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Hey, hey, hey. Hello, Anthem. Want to go for me? No, you're Sherry. All right. Well, put them underneath the tree. Okay. Uh, eggnog? Yes, please. Nice. Hey! Hey, sweetie. Hi, Hank. Oh. How are you? Well, I remember who you are, so it's a good day. <laughs> oh. Here we are. Thank you. You're welcome. Well, cheers. cheers. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Uh, you want to grab some food? I would love to. Be back Give in a minute. minute. I can't believe Calvin missed Eric's concert. You know, but the sad thing is, he's going to wake up someday, realize all the things he's missed out on, and really regret it. Yeah, well, he's not a total fool. He was smart enough to fall for you. Greatest sister-in-law ever. <laughs> You're cut off. <laughs> well, even Mom was crazy about you. And, and she, she was, was never, never wrong about, about anything. anything. I made them. For lemon snowballs? <clears throat> oh. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Go get First one's mom. free. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Hurry, come on. 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 Started at noon it's when Daddy. Calvin Carter, the company what? CEO, withdrew $1.2 million. That's $12,100 cool. bill. Carter said he wanted to make today special, and for thousands of lucky people, he did just that. Because before the day was over, an exhausted Carter had handed He's out all $12,000 no, bills. Was that? So, why did he do such an extraordinary thing? Let's ask the man himself. 
we all know that Christmas isn't about getting, it's about giving. Yeah. Um, I love this city because, uh, because the people of the city have been so good to uh, me and my family. But why 1.2 million? Well, it's $100,000 for each of the 12 days of Christmas. Well, this is going to be a Christmas people are going to remember for a very, very long time. Well, I, I hope so, Jenna. I sincerely do. Oh, and also, I just want to remind your viewers that um, in the spirit of Christmas, that all our stores nationwide will be open until 11 tonight. Oh. Merry Christmas, everyone. And God bless. It was incredible. Never experienced anything like it. Mm. We'll come back and see us. We'll do it again. Oh, I'll be back. We're going to be seeing a lot of each other. Oh. I promise you. Thank you, Miss Moore. Thank you. From the bottom of my heart. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Goodbye. Goodbye. Mm. I learned a lot about Christmas today, Drew. That is to share and share generously. I handed out over a million dollars. Gave it away. Yeah. Wow, that was really generous of you. I'm not fishing for compliments. Oh, no, you wouldn't do that, right? So what, did the TV crew just show up by itself? Wanted to use the media to inspire others. To be shameless self-promoters like you? All right, now look, I, I, I've only got eight days to figure this out. What's it going to take? I don't know. It's hard to say because every patient's different. Well, how am I going to know if I did it? Because you'll wake up and it'll be Christmas. And if I don't wake up? Oh. 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 Hope we have enough. I don't know. Uh, you have enough last year. Here, take this. And this. Yeah, thanks. All right, I think we have enough here, Dad. What? All right. Oh. Uh, 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 oh, no, I can't see. Come on. Oh, thanks. <laughs> yeah. Come on, come on, come on. <laughs> it's going to be fun. <clears throat> Merry Christmas. Goodbye. Thank you very much. Hey. Great time off, okay? Merry Christmas. Save yourself. Uh, Merry Christmas. Uh, Dad, I'll be, uh, bye -bye. I'll be right back. Why don't you, uh, Take care. Just, uh keep unloading. Okay. Hope you enjoy that. Uh, okay, Merry Christmas. Hey, Merry Christmas, you. Cal? Hey, there he is. Ah. What's going on? We're closed. Closed! Our flagship store, all the stores nationwide. Gave every employee day off with full pay. You have any idea how much money I'm going to lose? <laughs> huh? Have a great holiday. <laughs> hey, um, it's Christmas Eve, Kel. Dad Merry always Christmas. likes to walk the aisles and hand out the canes on Christmas Eve. <sighs> uh, not this year. He really looks forward to this. He's lucky there's still a store for him to come to. Lucky that somebody stepped in to save it. He loves this store, and he loves handing out the canes. Next year. Take care. He's losing his mind, Calvin. You know what? He may not have a next year. Oh, so you're just gonna spoil Dad's favorite day of the year so you can be a big shot? Yeah, I gave my employees a paid holiday. That's not being a big shot. That's being a leader. But you wouldn't know about that, would you? You're your father's son. So are you. Start acting like it. <laughs> 
manhole. You had me walk into an open manhole. Who, my wily coyote? <laughs> my personal favorite. Just trying to keep it interesting. Mm. So what else happened today? I'm giving to the wrong people, aren't I? Honey, you know how my brother sends us a gift every Christmas? You forget this year? Oh, no. He didn't forget. Mr. Carter, this delivery is for you. Mistake. I want this stuff out of here. No, we don't need any more. No, it's not a mistake, what? sir. This yeah, is but yours. we never ordered it, and we got a house full of stuff. I don't need it. Is this it. furniture? Mm -hmm. Top of the line for every room in the house. <sighs> I don't know how a guy can be so successful and so clueless at the same time. Understand? Come on, get. Dad, Dad. I mean, it's ridiculous. I know, I know. Just calm down, okay? I'll, 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 I'll deal with this. Well, okay. Um, so um, I'm gonna sign this, but it's so it's to be taken back. Yeah. Okay. Right. Excuse me, um, what are you doing? Delivering a boat. <laughs> I didn't order a boat. 820 Prospect Street, Marilyn Carter. Let me see that. It's awesome! <laughs> the cabin? Okay. It's Dad. Oh! Calvin? <laughs> is that a great boat or what? <laughs> Calvin, what is this all about? It's Christmas Eve, Marilyn. Feel the love. I don't want a boat, Kevin. It's for Eric. He's nine years old. It's awesome. It's got everything. Autopilot, radar, Xbox. He loves boats. He'll have a blast on it. With you? With whoever he wants. OK, listen to me, Calvin. We don't want a boat, OK? It's too expensive. It's. You don't object to the expensive gifts you get from me the rest of the year. Are you talking about child support? Incredibly generous child support and a house and a car. Let's not forget the huge settlement. OK, you know what? I don't have time for this, because I have a concert to get to, and Eric expects to see you there. Take it back. We don't want it. Just that. Eric! You! I didn't get a whole day. Well, it wasn't going very well. Hey, I only get 12 of these things. You can't cut them in half. I'll take it up with management. Right, you know what? I want to speak to your supervisor. Sorry, it's not possible. You're stuck with me. How come she gave me such a hard time? I had to pull a lot of strings to get that boat. Why do you have to be so over the top? Well, you know, I'm just an over the top kind of guy. And why do I have to be stuck with you? Because I was just the one on duty, so deal with it. Be safe. 
saving that for posterity. Real glad your mom could spare you for a few hours. Got a surprise for you. What are we going to do? See the city? Have ourselves a ball. Hello, Eric. I'm Isabel. We're going to have such a good time. Huh? Huh? <sighs> that was fun, buddy. Yeah. Maybe we could spend some time together. You coming in, Dad? I can't. Isabel's got a plane to catch. Merry Christmas, pal. Merry Christmas! Good night, Eric. Merry Christmas! <sighs> Did you do it? <laughs> you talk. Whoa! <laughs> cute. Very cute. But I almost made it. Yeah, it was very close to midnight. Oh, yeah? Well, actually, we gave you a little extra time to make up for the half day. It's no problem. Didn't make it to Christmas today, I'll just make it tomorrow. Mm. You got any uh, brothers or sisters, Ange? We don't have siblings. Uh, angels? Nurses. Oh. Well, a lot was expected of me, being the eldest. And then I watched Jesse get all the attention. Maybe he was nicer. My mother seemed to think so. Yeah. Your mom. I know that's painful to think about, huh? Not being there when she... I couldn't be there. Could I? Had to be in L.A. Had to deal with a regional management team in complete meltdown. Right, and business always comes first, right? Well, a lot of people depend on their business, including my mother. And who do you think paid for the private duty nurses and high-ticket specialists? For all the good of debtor. I wanted to be there. I know. It's hard to be there schedule. Hard to find the time. You've got to do something. He won't listen to me. <laughs> if I were home today, this is what I would be doing with my family. Calvin? Hey! What's going on? We're preparing a feast, little brother. A Christmas party that your friends will talk about forever. Preparing a feast. <laughs> You're redecorating our house. It's my Christmas present to you. Have you forgotten what our party is? Uh, of course you have. You, you, you've stopped coming to our party ever since you fell in love with the almighty buck stops here. Party's a party, Jesse. Uh, I'm just trying to make it as good as I possibly can. Our party is a gift from Sarah and me to our family and friends, Calvin. I'm just trying to help. No. You're trying to remind us that we can't possibly live up to the extraordinary standards of the great Calvin Carter. I just can't win with you, can I? I? I gave up my whole day for you. What do you want? I want you to get out of here and take Santa's elves with you. It's not fair. It, it, it's not fair. I mean, I have done everything. I have bought, I have given, I have spent time with my family. Nobody appreciates what I do for them. You know what, that's fine. That's fine, okay? Because from now on, it's just going to be about me, me, and me. Call the ballets, would you? Christmas presents for me, from me. That was incredible. Worth the two months' wait? Every second of it. Could I interest you in a little dessert? Uh, yeah. What I really want isn't on the menu. Oh. Oh. Hey, 
Kelvin, are you there? Come on, I'm dying out here. I'm trying to keep Miss Frizz entertained, but I'm not you. Please. Ah. Uh, mm. Wow. Mm. <laughs> La Petite Maison should definitely put that on the dessert menu. Yeah. It'd be very, very tough to get a reservation there. Mm. <laughs> I'm not complaining, but how come you're not working today? Well, it's Christmas Eve, and I uh, thought I'd treat myself, fulfill my every fantasy, indulge my every pleasure. So what am I, fantasy or a pleasure? Well, you're both, baby. A daily double. <laughs> how romantic. And for this afternoon, I've booked our ultimate fantasy. What? Uh, you know what? No! Mm, four o'clock. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Are we ready? Uh, we'll find out. You do it just like you've been trained. You'll be all right. Okay. You guys ready to go? Okay. Agreed. No more half days. It, it wasn't us. I promise you. The parachute malfunctioned on its own. You know what? You know what? <laughs> That's it. That's it. I've had it. I've had it. This game is rigged. You said so yourself. I play by the rules. And when the people I work with don't, I walk. Get back into bed. Oh, please. You Whatever I do, I'm not going to make it to Christmas. Oh. So why don't you just torture some other sucker, no, okay? Wait. Don't step out of the light. Don't step out of the light. Oh, Calvin! Calvin! Here. Sorry. You're a pain in the ass, you know that? Well, maybe you should have just left me out Ugh. there then. Then you wouldn't make it to Christmas. <sighs> Boy. You know, I've never lost a patient before. Here, you must be freezing. Uh. Uh. 
shoot broke, huh? That means Rihanna could have been wearing it. Yeah, that's right. When I was falling, and I knew I was gonna die again, I was thinking that I never told Rihanna how I felt about her. Then it's good that you have a few more days. Uh, only three. That's plenty of time. Those other beds, how come they're empty? Oh, uh, well, those patients figured it out. They made it to Christmas. Uh, I'm the only one who has it, huh? Hey, you're special. Hey, good luck tomorrow. Luck has nothing to do with it. Uh, so what's all this? Well, uh, I didn't have time to get your real roses. Uh, and, uh, well, I've been thinking long and hard about uh, what to give you for Christmas. What, to stop making lingerie? <laughs> <laughs> and uh, I, I think I've... I finally realized what it is I want to give you. Rihanna. Will you marry me? You want to get married? With all my heart. But we never talked about getting married. Well, we are now. So where's the ring? Well, I, I, I didn't have time to get one of those either. Oh. But you've been thinking about it long and hard. I'm, I'm sorry, Calvin. I don't want to marry you. Why not? Because when I get married, it'll be to share a life with someone, to have a family. I could do that. Yeah, you already have. And that marriage failed. And... And I've seen how you are as a father. Uh, so, uh... If, if, if this thing that we are isn't leading to marriage, then what is it? <sighs> That's a really good question. I better get dressed. Calvin, where are you? I ran out of small talk hours ago. Isabel Frias looks like she's ready to kill me, and I don't blame her. Call me. Hello, Calvin. You missed the concert. Call me. You push, I jump. What difference does it it's make? It's not your choice to make. Oh, I don't know how to have the best Christmas Eve ever. That's your problem, you know? You're always trying to control everything, oh. but you can't. No one can. Oh, you know what? That's, that's, I'm tired. I'm tired. I want to go to sleep. Fine. Good morning, Stacy. She's here. Her plane was early. Uh, is Calvin in yet? He's not coming. What do you mean he's delayed? He's not coming at all. Well, what am I supposed to do with Isabel Freyas? Mr. Carter emailed the detailed agenda. But this is broken up into 15-minute increments, and her plane doesn't leave until 9 to 9.
well. It's, it's good to see you. Are you doing okay? Are you still at the shelter? Okay, we need some food. How are you doing? It's good to see you. So you're still doing okay out there, Mr. What is it? Uh, turkey stew. Real turkey or turkey roll? It'll make a difference. Let it rip. How you doing tonight, Henry? Do you mind if I sit here? No. Thanks. Your first time here? I, uh, yeah. I just wanted to help out a little bit. Thanks. There are a lot of homeless here. Some of these people aren't homeless. Some are uh, what I call perpetual hard cases. What's that? Addiction? mental health problems, families down on their luck, and people who have made a lot of really bad choices. That's rough. Giving up your Christmas with family and friends to come down here, that's good karma. Karma, is that a Catholic concept? <laughs> Small C Catholic? Oh. It is. Mm. Where have you been all day? I volunteered at a soup kitchen. <laughs> so, uh, anyway, stay on schedule? Oh, yeah, Did sure, sure, sure. We did, we did everything. Uh, all the stores, uh, even your elementary school. Uh, well, I'm sure she appreciated it. No, I'm sure she didn't. She wanted to be with the great man himself, not some lackey. Oh, he's not a lackey. But I wanted to be with my family. It's, it's Christmas Eve, Calvin. Useful. No one could accuse me of hogging the spotlight or having an ulterior motive. One day left, Calvin. You can do it. Um, please. It's too late. I need 12 more days just to even get started. Uh, one may know how to conquer without being <sighs> able to do it. The art of war. What a crock. Sit up. What? Sit up. Oh! Wake up, Calvin. What are you thinking? That there's not enough time to get it right, so suddenly failure is an option? Help me out here. Why did you have Drew spend the whole day working on the expansion of a business you're never going to see again? Well, I told you a lot of people depend on that business. So a lot of people will miss you if you don't make it to Christmas. Oh, not me, my checkbook. Your checkbook? Calvin, come on. 11 days we've been at this and you still think that? You know, I'm the girl around here for cracking hard cases, Calvin, but you may just be uncrackable. Christmas Eve, Santa. So are we still on for lunch? Absolutely.
Good morning, Mr. Carter. Barry. Uh, look, I was gonna give you this tomorrow, but it's in case I don't see you. Merry Christmas. Thanks. <laughs> uh, hey, Drew, uh, forget it. Just get out of here. Yeah, but I thought nah, we were it's meeting Christmas with... Eve. And you should be home with Tara and, um, um... Uh, Morgan and Nate. Right. Morgan and Nate. All right. Great. Hey, Drew. That whole failure is not an option stuff. You never really bought that, did you? No. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, Calvin. She's here. Her plane was early. Go home, Stacy. Christmas bonus. I already got a Christmas bonus. <gasps> oh, thank you! Calvin Carter. You so good for us. I know you've gone out of your way to come here, but today's not a good day. It's Christmas Eve. You should be with your family. What do you mean? Well, I rebooked your flight. You're leaving in an hour and a half. My limo's waiting for you downstairs. But it's okay. It's okay. You don't like the food? Uh, no. It's it's uh, it's fine. I'm just, I'm just not really hungry. What is it? What's the matter? We are. I mean, we're not really going anywhere, are we? Oh, my God. Are you dumping me? Oh, Rihanna. Rihanna. Baby. I, I, I adore you. I, I lust for you. I, you make me laugh. <laughs> but we don't really have a future. Yes, we do. No, we don't. No, we don't. I'm just arm candy. Sooner rather than later, you're going to want to have a family. You don't want to have a family. You don't know that. But you do. OK. Something's the matter, something besides us. Well, there's a million things that are the matter. I'm just trying to acknowledge the bigger things before I Well, before the carriage turns into a pumpkin and I'm a rat again. I appreciate you being honest with me. It means a lot. Business meeting to get to? <laughs> that's a, it's a concert. Business things I'm good at. It's personal stuff. Not... Uh... Merry Christmas. Hope Santa brings you everything you ever asked for. Just observe it. Dad, this is like the best day ever. Great. Hey, uh, tell me something. When you were singing up there, were you nervous at all? A little. Really? You didn't show it, boy. You know, people do that sometimes. They they hide what they're really feeling. You know? I mean, uh, I do that. You do? Sure, I do. I mean, for instance, I, I don't tell you often enough how much I love you. I know you love me, Dad. <laughs> and how much I, I miss doing stuff with you. You're busy. You're an important guy, Dad. Not really. I act like one. It's, it's really important to spend time with, with people that you care about and to let them know that you care. I want you to, I want you to promise to try and do that, OK? Sure. Yeah? All right, let's go. Oh. I'm 
Mexico. Look who's here. Hey. Oh. Oh. Shot quite a collection. I love the love it. Thank you. <laughs> hey, Uncle Calvin. Hey. How are you? Good. Uh, okay. All right. Let's go. Yeah, tear it up. Up, 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 up. Yeah. Hey, hey, hey. Calvin? Yeah. Here, let me help you one of those. Come on. Hey, guys. <laughs> well, this is a nice surprise. You haven't been to one of our parties in years? Yeah, my loss. <laughs> you know, I never thank you for taking care of Dad. Hey, you pay for it. Well, it's easy to write a check. You do the hard part. Not really. I like having him around. That's because you're a good guy. <laughs> I'm really. I, I envy you. Oh, well, what part of me do you envy? My uh, my high school teacher's salary, or my uh, my bad eyes, <laughs> or my utter inability to carry a tune? Oh, well, all of that. All of it. Well, I mean, we are who we are, Cal. I guess I'm. I guess I'm just pretty good at being me. Yeah. I guess that's what I envy the most. You need an eggnog, because you're not feeling eggnog. near sentimental Can't enough. Give me that eggnog. <laughs> Make it a dump. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh that's... Mom's lemon snow bars. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, can I? <laughs> okay. Oh, my God. <laughs> Oh, my mm. Hey, you know, uh, Eric had a really good time today. I should do it more often. I wish I could. Wish I had. Well, you just have to make it a priority. Yeah. Finally, finally figured that one out, didn't I? Well, then why don't you do it? Calvin, he's your son. He loves you. He needs you. A little late for that, don't you think? What do you mean it's a little late? Hey, what Cat. is that? I made you a gift for Christmas. Excuse me. Uh. Hey. You know what? I think I need some help putting these snow bars on the plate. Can you give me a hand? I'm losing my mind, you know. I forget things, lots of things. Yeah, me too. I'm, I'm, I've run out of time, Dad. I, I had all the time I needed. I, I had all the time in the world, and now I've wasted it. We all feel that way sometimes. Yeah, but like Mom, I mean, I should have been there. I should have. Wouldn't have made any difference. She was proud of you. She, she understood. Well, I, I was sore at you for not coming, but uh, none of us is perfect. I mean, you've got your faults, but you're a good guy at heart. You know how I know? Your mother told me so, and she was never wrong.
Let's go in. Let's get cold, okay? Okay. okay. Mm. Calvin? I'm sorry. Oh, no. Calvin? No. Calvin? Oh. 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 Good drop. Merry Christmas. Yeah. So what happened this time? Heart attack? Heartburn. Too much eggnog. Should lay off the stuff. Wait a minute. What did you just say? I said lay off the eggnog. No, 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 no. Did you say Merry Christmas? Yeah. Is it Christmas? Did I make it to Christmas? Yeah, we all made it to Christmas. I made it to Christmas? Oh! oh. Hey! Hey! I made it! Merry Christmas. Thank you. Calvin? Calvin. Oh, you scared the hell out of me. Hey. Merry Christmas, brother. <laughs> Let's get you out of here. Okay. Uh, would, would you just just uh, give me a minute? Everything. It's not a destination. It's a journey. God is in the details, Calvin. I think I spent enough time in hospitals. My family's waiting for me. So get out of here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Hey, <laughs> 